What's up, guys? Welcome back to another week of online school. Um, I believe this is week eight of online school, and we have just one more week after that being our last week of school. Uh, I'm just uh, going to use this video to encourage you guys a little bit um, and go over just kind of just a review of uh, just different parts of Canvas, as well as what to um, look at this week and where to go for that. Um, hey, but as always, guys, I, I do hope you guys are doing well. Uh, you guys are safe and healthy, making good choices and everything. Uh, know that I am really proud of you guys. I know you guys have come a long way with online learning, um, including myself, um, and like making all these videos now too. Uh, I'm not that great at making videos still, as you can see in the videos even this week. But uh, but I appreciate y'all's patience and working with me still. And uh, and yeah, I'm, I'm really proud of you guys. Y'all have come a long way. Um, I just uh, let's finish this this school year off strong. And uh, let's let's try and get as much done as we can leading into the summer, and hopefully, hopefully things will start opening up more even soon, um, so that you guys uh, can all go see all your friends again and everything, and uh, and and we can all maybe even go out and just you know all obviously anyway, uh, hopefully just things start getting better for you guys and for everyone. Um, but yeah, I'm really proud of you guys. Let's go ahead and jump into this week and look at what it's going to look like and how it's going to go. Um, so first off the bat, just on the home screen here, you'll see the new video here. This is obviously last week because I'm making this video right now. But you'll see that here and just some uh, just a reminder of the, looking at it. You'll see the online hour, office hours here from 11 to 12 and 3 to 4. So I can always go outside those hours. Just let me know and I'll do my best. I can set up Zoom meetings, things like that too. Just please let me know um, via email, like through email or, uh, or the chat option. So again, there's the chat option here. Chat for some reason doesn't notify me, but I try to look at it a couple times every day. And uh, if I see that someone posted, I usually try to respond as quick as I can. Um, you can do the inbox option as well. Just click on it. You'll see where there's somewhere where you can make a new message and just send me a message through that as well. Or just send me an email if you know how to do it through just regular email. You'll see the video here again, just as a reminder in case you, you know, happen to for some reason not see it. Uh, if you need Spanish to English dictionary, just as a reminder, that's it right here. If you click this link, um, this just does main English words for like the English class. Okay, so that's all that really is there for you guys if any of y'all need that. Uh, there's also the immersive reader option, which um, I may show here in a little bit. Um, and then here's the news for this week, uh, which I need to update. So just ignore kind of what this says. Um, and I'm just actually going to go into the news by clicking modules. So click on modules as you should hopefully be doing every week because this is the easiest way to where, find, where you can find everything. So first off, modules are basically um, set up like folders. So you'll see here, it's like darker gray here and then, and then just a white background here. This is like a, a drop box, if you will. So there's this arrow, it can go up and down and it drops it up and down. And so that's one file folder, second file folder, and you have what's in the file is here. So think of like a, you know, like a binder. And so this is a binder here. And what's in this binder? Just this, is, um, just this right here and so on. You'll see that everything is um, unlocked for you guys. Um, you'll see that everything is unlocked uh, since the first week of online school. Sorry, my phone was going off. You'll see everything unlocked still here from uh, the first week of online school. If you happen to be missing anything, you guys can find it all here, the assignment, the instructions, anything you'll see all right here, um, including all the videos with those instructions and assignments too. Um, all right, so go all the way to the bottom and you'll see that there's one file here or yeah, one file here, so or Dropbox. So it says Monday through Friday's major grade project work. It is all on one page this week because it is just the major grade. So everything is like, all on one main page this week for instructions because this week all that's required is um, turning in that major grade. And so, um, and that's it. So th there's two grades this week. It's the major grade and then you'll get an other grade as well. That other grade is if you signed in on Canvas, way to go. Um, but you still need to obviously do that major grade too and turn that in. So a couple quick things, you'll see that there's Summer Reading 2020. If you click on this, it'll give you all the instructions and everything about Summer Reading 2020, plus a video with it. You go to Monday through Friday work this week, it talks about everything for this major grade project. These are just the instructions. So click on it, there's another video there. It's a long one, but there's another video there. 
And then also the turn in, which is the assignment right here. And you click on this to turn in your project. So there's videos all on this for you guys to look at and utilize. One last thing I do wanna show you guys that I didn't go into on my other videos that you may have forgotten. So um, this says it's locked, um, but what's really cool, um, cause I can still show it, uh, with all these instructions, if you click immersive reader, which you'll see, and it's locked cause I'm in student view, by the way, I'm in student view, because this is what you guys will see. Obviously, again, you'll see it unlocked though. Immersive reader may not work right now cause it is locked, but basically um, if you click that immersive reader button, you'll see everything come up that's on this page just spaced out more and look a little different, but uh, it's to help you be able to read it more, but read it better if you need that. There's a little play button at the bottom there too. If you click that play button on Immersive Reader, it'll actually read it for you. Obviously there's my video that you'll see on this page that explains and reads through all of it too. So it's your choice on what you wanna to listen to. Um, I will say my explanation goes more in detail outside of just reading instructions. But that is there for you guys. There's also a Spanish option or other languages option. If you guys need help with any other languages, you can click it on there and explore it. It's all there for you guys. Um, and I think that is actually it. So major grade project this week, that major grade goes with the minor grade from last week. Just watch that video and read these instructions. And then the other grade, which is, um, just time, signing into Canvas. So, but that's it. Um, you'll see this updated here in a little bit after this video. I forgot to do it, but I'm gonna go ahead and make, be done making this video. Um, but basically it'll just talk about and say that the, the only thing changed is the, that the major grade, it, that there's a major grade this week and the other grade is just signing into Canvas. So, um, and then it's the encouragement of course, which I always do mean um, from the bottom of my heart. So again, don't forget, chat send me a message inbox send me an email please if you need help i will do my best to help you guys and then also the last week of school because it is in another video but it's a long one and you may not see it last week of school next week is is just for any miss students that have missing assignments if you are done with this project and turn it in you are done for sixth grade english school year and you have nothing else to turn in if you're not missing anything or anything that last week of school is is done you don't have to do any more sixth grade english work obviously i'd love if you'd read every day still and write every day because that's good to to keep going and keep that good ha those good habits because it builds you as a person and student and uh and helps you get stronger in reading and writing so that in the future you'll do even better with things um in your job and your future classes with uh you know just everything in life so but um and I, and I know this video is getting long, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Um, again, I know I say it all the time now, but I do love and miss you guys. Be well, be safe, make good choices, have a good week or day, whatever time you're watching this video. And I will see y'all in the next video. So 